Hello everyone, I hope you're doing well. Welcome to start a new weekly vlog. It's Monday, I'm at Gleam. I'm just importing some footage to edit, but I thought whilst I wait for that then, I would open my PO box. It's overflowing. We've um, started doing Polaroids to like differentiate what our own PO box. This is mine. So look, I'm all immediately very excited about Lush. Okay, so Lush have sent me a box of some of their newest products. Look how cool these are. So they're reusable bubble bars on a stick, which makes them so easy to use. I normally find it quite difficult to crumble them under the tap, but these are so handy. This one smells amazing. I'm not sure of the flavor, but it smells like a sweet, like a refresher, I think. This one is mint. This one is candy, and it's the, the Snow Fairy fragrance. So nice. They've also got, I think, a bath melt and this little one, which would be so cute under the tap because it would just spin. Love these. Thank you so much, Lush. I'm looking forward to lots of bubble bars, baths in my new flat soon. I've kind of just emptied everything onto the desk behind me. There's so much stuff. I haven't come and picked this up in a while, so it's really overflowing. I feel very lucky. I'm going to show you some little you bits. Oh, sorry. <laughs> No, you're amazing. Yeah, no, we were just talking about it. What? <laughs> we're always in the office at the same always. time. And I'm just doing my makeup. <laughs> um, I was telling Naomi all about coming off the pill this morning. Yeah. It's been very interesting. It's crazy because like hormones just control so much of your body. And, and you, you don't realise. You don't realise at the time. Scary. Until you come off it and then you're like, oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah. It's so scary. It's not good. Okay, so now Tink has sent these beautiful summer shades. They're really shimmery, actually. We've only got two kind of like mattish gel ones the rest have a nice iridescent shimmer to them very cute the body shop have sent some of their new banana hair care range this is so nostalgic the smell is like those foam bananas really nice so they've got the body yogurt which sinks in in 15 seconds also all this range is vegan which is so nice you've got the shampoo <laughs> and the hair mask which i've never tried before but i I'm in desperate need because my hair, with all the heat recently, I think it's getting a bit frazzled. So I'm gonna try these out. What I'm about to show you is one of the best products I've ever received in my PO box. I squealed when I saw this. It's an allergy reliever. This is literally what I was talking about a couple of vlogs back about what my dad bought me years ago to help stop my hay fever. It's like a little thing with two prongs that you stick up your nose and you need to use it like a couple of times a day and then in a couple of weeks your hay fever will like your symptoms will be really gone so yeah so excited just about to use it looks like this so funny lucy and lydia have teamed up with tangle teaser to release two mini compact stylers how cute are these they've also said their new wet detangling brush um it looked it used to look really different than this but they've kind of developed it so now it looks like this much easier to hold i'm looking forward to trying this comex have released a new watermelon flavor so summery also really excited about this new benefit hello happy foundation i've seen so many people talking about this so i can't wait to try it myself bobby brown have sent some kind of setting and base products so we've got a hydrating primer plus three in one setting spray perfect for this weather right now because it's too hot and i've also spotted that they've got an spf 50 primer which is right up my street so i'm definitely going to be trying this pixie have just launched some of these kind of like shimmery glimmery eyeshadows called the liquid fairy lights i've just swatched two of them on my hands and they're so pretty, perfect for festivals and also festive season, probably. They've also got some highlighters here. Quite similarly, Lottie London have released some eye, eye foils and these look really similar, like glittery eyeshadows. I have been utterly spoiled by L'Oreal who have sent their whole new collection of Colour Rouge lipsticks. Um, I'm guessing that these are like glosses, like shines. These ones are all matte and then these ones just must be like normal lipsticks let me know if you would like swatches of any of these I'm absolutely freaking out about this this is the coolest thing ever and i love these um shower gels i use them all the time in my shower at the moment i just love that they've got a pump it makes it really handy and finally we have an elemis spf 30 sun protection which i'm all of all over and then i think these might have come from the company itself the old english company they've sent a planner a couple of cards and this pin, which I think is just adorable, it's very me, love books. I'll link them down below as well. Made myself a little pat lunch, shouldn't I? Look at this. 
chili, last night's chili with coriander and rice. I am now leaving Gleam at six o'clock to go and meet my school friends. We're having like a little bit of a reunion um, and my new housemate's gonna be there because that is how we met through school. So yeah, excited. We're going to the lighter men in King's Cross, which should be nice. I'll show you what I'm wearing quickly. I'm wearing this polka dot mini skirt from Primark with a t-shirt, which I've just done up here. My boobs are looking massive today because I came off the pill recently. Got a lovely salad and chips. It's Thursday, very exciting day today because I'm finally going to get my hair sorted out. Look how big my roots are. <laughs> literally can't get over it it's been three months i think since i last had them done but i'm going to the samantha acoustic salon today my favorite place and i think we're gonna cut this middle parting in and do the roots and have a bit of a trim maybe add some layers i'm very excited first though i'm going to a, an event i'm going to fenty beauty's new they've got like a pop-up shop in king's cross so i'm gonna go and head down to that for an hour or so and then go to the salon. Oh, I'm also going to the, the theatre tonight with my mum and dad, which I'm really looking forward to too. I am wearing all black today. Um, I'm wearing this jumpsuit from ASOS. I got this years ago, but it's like my favourite thing ever. The way it sits on me is really nice. It's petite. New look sandals. Just got an old H&M bag and a little new look cardi as well. So I'm now at the event and I'm just being colour matched to my shades. I think I'm one... Ten? Ten? This one here. The other ones are too dark, I think. Also just spoke to Rihanna's personal makeup artist as well, which is pretty cool. Okay, so we've just taken my makeup off. This is what my skin's looking like. I've decided to go for this foundation all over so we can see what it probably wears like throughout the day. So this is medium coverage. I really love it. It looks really natural. I've just come to like the Grove for my hair appointment, but I'm a bit early, so I decided to stop and have some breakfast. I've got a soy latte, a birch muesli from Pret, and I've also got their vegan cookie that I want to try later on. I've got half an hour till my appointment. I decided to go and get the team at the salon some more donuts. I got them donut time last time, and I think I'm going to do the same now just to perk up their Thursday. So I'm just walking there. I think I'm going to get a box of six. Um, I'm excited to see what flavours they've got. I don't know how to use the fork. Yeah, there you go. Do you want? Thank you. I am at the salon. I've had my colour and bleach done. I'm so excited. Going for something a little bit different. This is always my favourite part of coming to this salon. Mermaid martini. Got a little corby glass and some candy floss. Oh. So cute. My hair is now done. I forgot to show you properly in the salon, but I'll show you properly when we get home tonight. We went for like a darker purple grey so that it will fade out to a really nice pastel and last a lot longer than it normally does. Um, and I had a bit of a trim and I had my centre parting cut in, which I'm so happy about. Um, I am in desperate need of my brows being done so I know there's a HG brows like shop here so I'm going to see if they've got space to fit me in and then I'm going to feel like a complete new woman. <laughs> Boo, they were full. Um, oh well, so I'm going to head to Charing Cross now. I think maybe I'll find somewhere around there that I can get my brows done. I've met up with my parents and we've come to ZZ's for dinner. I've got a, I think like a vegetarian ravioli. I've just got home from seeing Kinky Boots at the theatre and it was so good, honestly, so much fun. My mum and dad loved it too. We were all like standing and clapping and dancing at the end. It's such a good like feel good musical and I'm not, I'm going to admit I'm not the biggest fan of musicals at all but I really wanted to see this one and I'm really glad we did. Go and see it if you can like it's very rare for me to see a musical that has a standing ovation and that did 
everyone had a great time. I'm gonna go to bed now, but I will see you tomorrow. I've got an event tomorrow and then I'm going to circus because our show's next week and I need to get some more like practice time in before then. So I will see you then. Good morning, it's Friday. I am ready for an event. Estee Lauder are holding an event today where it's all about foundation, all about their double wear range. So I'm just gonna pop down and get color matched. I've never found like my perfect color in double wear because I am quite pale, a lot of um, them in the past have tended to be a bit too dark for me so hopefully we'll find the right shade today and then yeah i'm gonna come back here and then work all day and then get ready for circus tonight so it should be a nice kind of chilled friday which is good i'm embracing the fact that i've now got like pastel kind of purple hair and i've chosen a very pastel outfit today so i've got a white off the shoulder t-shirt on from primark which was like four pounds i've got this gorgeous corduroy pink pastel pink skirt from h&m and i've got my pastel blue bag from topshop i think this was a while ago I got this, so I don't think it's available anymore, but I think this is really cute. I am then wearing black shoes, which kind of don't go, but I don't have any nude ones. So I'm at the event and I just had my skin matched to double wear and she put it all over. How nice does my skin look? She mixed it with a tiny bit of the advanced night repair serum, I think. Um, and yeah, I feel really like dewy, but full coverage, beautiful. Look at, also look at this. I need this set up in my bathroom. Okay, I just finished up at the Estee Lauder event and I've made um, a quick detour to West of Stratford to pick up my mulberry bag. She's just got fixed. Um, I'll show you what was wrong with her when I get back home, but yeah, I'm very excited to have her back because it's been like almost two months. I've I need to pop into Zara because they've, oh no, can I be bothered? No, I can't be bothered. Can't be bothered to pop into Zara. They've got a sale on, but I'd rather just look at home. But I might pop into New Look to see if they've got any nude sandals because they'd go much better with my outfits this summer than the black ones I'm wearing currently. I've just got home, bunged my hair up, um, and made myself some lunch. Oh, it's so hot today, but I feel like I need loads of vegetables. So I've made literally just a bowl of broccoli with hot sauce and coriander. And then I've made my go-to apple and goat cheese salad with balsamic and paprika. So I'm going to munch on these now. Looking at this makes me so happy because it's so healthy. Really quickly, three things. Found some sandals. They were the last pair in New Look that were identical to my current black ones in a more neutral shade in my size. So it was definitely fate. They were gorgeous like tan brown. They're a lot lighter in real life than showing on here but yeah I'm chuffed with these I tried them on in store and they went so much better with the outfit I was wearing today so that's great second thing mulberry bag is back so excited so the reason I went and sent it off to get repaired is because obviously it's a lot of money this bag it's not it's not cheap um and I'd had it for less than a year like literally five months and this um gold like lock detail had gone silver and I was like I'm not I'm not putting up with that that's really terrible like it should be made to last a lifetime so yeah they replaced that and it looks it's still got the um thing on which I might actually keep on for a while but it looks so much better there was something else I was gonna say but I actually can't remember <laughs> oh yeah my foundation I've just topped up a tiny bit of concealer but I didn't really need to I've been wearing this double wear foundation for I've been wearing it for eight hours now and look my skin also bearing in mind it's 30 degrees today it's absolutely roasting and my skin looks like this. I'm chuffed, it's really lasted a long time. So it's great, it's gonna be my new go-to foundation, I think. I'm on my way to circus now, I've got my gym kit on, I might put a little t-shirt on as well, but I'm gonna bring you along with me, and this is the last time I get to practice my routine before my show next Tuesday, which I'll vlog for you as well. <laughs>
10 o'clock and I've just made dinner. This is too late to be eating. I've got beans on toast with eggs. I need a bit of protein. I'm starving. It is Saturday. I am with my, my gorgeous little sister <coughs> who's got having like an asthma attack. <laughs> She's gone all wheezy, I think, because of the aircon and the heat. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. Are you going to be okay? Yeah. Yeah. So it's the um, day of the England match. So we were going to go to my local pub to watch it, but we thought it would be way too busy and rowdy and probably really sweaty. So now we've made a plan. We're going to go to Matalan just to return some bits we bought a couple of weeks ago. And then we're going to go Tesco and pick up some picnicky bits. And then we're going to go back to my parents' house and watch the game from there. And then we can sit in their garden as well, which will be nice. Just in Matalan, I want a really nice like summer bag, like the wicker whole the whole wicker thing. So I found two in the sale. This one, which I think would be great, but it's quite big. And then also this one, which I think I'm gonna get. It's cute. I'll leave a link to it down below. But um they've got one in HM which is identical, but it sold out last night on their sale. So I'm really glad I found a dupe for even cheaper. My sister's got a top tip for when you're shopping in the sale. What is it? always check the armpits because having worked in retail people try them people wrong don't put deodorant on and they retain it but they shouldn't retain it or they try it on in the change rooms maybe as well mm. that's a great tip i am at my parents house now i quickly went back to mine i'm gonna sit in your bed bex i've decided to stay at my parents house overnight being as my sister and i are going out with my cousins tomorrow and it was just easier for me to stay here so we're back, picked all my stuff. Also means I can have a drink today whilst watching the football. We won the match. It's boiling hot. It's like 31 degrees. So I'm just going to take my foundation off. And then we're going to go and sit in the garden. It's coming on. It's coming on. It's coming on. I'm really happy with my foundation though. I'm wearing the Estee Lauder one again and it's great. Right. Double wear. <laughs> yeah, double wear. They've got shades pale enough for me now. So that's good. It's coming on. It's coming on. I am now up in my room at my parents' house. I'm going to end the vlog now. I'm sorry I didn't film them much of the day. I've just been having some family time. But yeah, it's nice. It's so hot. This is like the attic room and it's so hot right now. And I know that I'm going to leave the window open and I'm going to be covered in nap bites tomorrow. I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. Do be sure to subscribe if you enjoyed it. And I will see you on Sunday for another main channel video. And this one's going to be a good one. Stay tuned.